Um, I love politics, and I'm, and I'm, I'm genuinely, I believe that there are, despite the Marjorie Taylor Greens, that there, a majority of public servants are good people, that they are in it to do good things. What motivates you to stay in the fight? And I, I'm going to assume you, you're going to grow in your career, you may seek higher office. Why keep going? Why keep fighting? When I made the decision to, I, at one point in my life, had the realization that I'm not going to be here forever. And my life is going by very quickly. And I had, like many of us, like a quarter-life crisis where I was like, oh my God, what am I going to do? Like, I don't want to do what I'm doing my whole life. And I need to do something that's going to be meaningful and make a difference. So that's why I went into government and public service. I really want to, during my... If you think about it, we're on... This quick, we're on Earth, if you think about it. And what are we each going to do to make an impact? No one ever says at people's funerals, they took amazing vacations. <laughs> they had the best boats, the best... No, it's what did you do, the people you touched... And by the way, um, it doesn't mean you have to be in politics. You could be like on, on boards. You could help in your... You can be active in so many different ways... You can help people in your life. You could adopt a, um, you know, have a, you could mentor people. There's so many different ways. But to me, I want to look back one day, when I'm in the rocking chair, I want to look back and uh, really be able to say that I helped make a difference. Well, Eric, well, and, uh, thank you so much for being here. Thank you. Thank you.